Utah could soon be home to one of the nation's most advanced data centers. Construction's about to begin in Millard County on a new facility designed to power AI technology without relying on the local power grid. The specialist Alex Cabrera was at a groundbreaking today to see what this means for the community. Alex? It's safe to say tractors and farms built Millard County. We are an agriculture county. But Millard County Commissioner Bill Wright knows times are changing. We look forward that we can take the new technology and in the industry like this and really be able to mold it together with what we're doing. One, two, three, let's yeah. do this thing. And what they're doing involves artificial intelligence. The Jewel Energy and Data Center campus, which will be located near Holden, will be a data center for the growing use of AI, which takes a lot of electricity and server space. So that when you're asking one of the AI models a question, back here in these buildings, it's doing all the work to get you that answer. Company managers say what makes this center unique and a possible model for future data centers is not relying on the local power grid. Co-CEO Brock Andrews says that wouldn't be fair to locals. It really takes away from resources that the local residents need and it increases energy costs for everybody else. So we said, let's create our own power production plants here on this beautiful 4,000 acres. Instead, Jewel will produce its own power using natural gas. It's the type of project that will bring jobs to rural Utah. And when it comes to jobs, Commissioner Wright wants classes and apprenticeships for local students so they won't have to move away for work. Although it sounds nice, we don't want to hire people from Georgia and Alabama or New York or near. We want to prepare our students here. It's different from livestock or crops, but in a way, it's a new kind of harvest where Millard County is planting seeds for the future. I know this, that everybody else in this state is jealous of us. Two representatives say they hope to begin energy production at this time next year. They also say they know that is an aggressive plan, but one they feel they can accomplish. And they also say, remember, this is only phase one. They have a lot more planned for the future. In Millard County, Alex Cabrero, KSL 5 News.